Hi everyone, Boris here with another Minecraft map. This is called The Pointless Button by Zved. Uh, we played the hospital before, but also by Zved. This map apparently doesn't have any purpose. Apparently. The entire map is designed on the idea that, uh, that it's insane. Pointless button, the crazy experience, a custom app by Zved, usually.com slash vedding, easy. Click me for rules and introduction, click. We've already had the rules, I think, do not break blocks, yeah. Uh, have command what's on, they are, be completely pointless. What would you do if you were trapped in a room with a button that had no effect? Would you keep pressing it? Will it explain your problems? Try it out. Okay, so we've got some buttons here. Make it light. The light came on. Nice. Make it dark. It's gone dark. Make it light again. Nice. Make it shady clear. It's probably going to start raining now. Let's hit that and hit that. We'll have it light. Fine. We've already had the rules. Right, off we go. So let's see what the button does. I have no idea what to expect. The point of this map is that it's crazy. Button. I click the button. Nothing happens. I got teleported. This is a giraffe. Oh my word, that's a weird looking giraffe. Wow, his name is Ron. You must feed him one of these two apples. What? What? Ah! What? I'm now confused. Okay, so what happened? You must feed him one of these apples twice, two times per day. What do you mean? Does it like a giraffe? Well then, how about now? <laughs> nice, there's a button up there. Uh, oh, brown, okay. If this puzzle is too hard, you may break the clay. There's a chest here with a golden nugget and a lever. I'll take it all. There's a pressure plate pad there. Right, so we've got a button up there. What was the name of the giraffe? Rename a piece of paper to the answer. Case sensitive, use an anvil. And sorry, paper, where's the anvil? Where's the anvil? Is it over here? Puzzle one. Introducing nothing. So we've got a button up there. And I don't have a piece of paper. There wasn't one in the chest, was there? What's this golden block doing here? Are there any of the golden blocks? Hmm. Well. Got a golden nugget. I'm going to put that. Wait, no, this pressure plate. There's a wooden one. I thought it was a stone one. Oh, damn it. I want it. Damn it. Right, I pressed the button. What? I've got... Oh, I now have two golden nuggets. What happened there? Was that a jute bug? Right. And then press the button. Oh, paper. I need an anvil, though. This gives me paper. But I need an anvil. I haven't got an anvil. Also, there's a ladder behind there. I know his name was Ron. Because it says there, his name was Ron. But there's no anvil. I'm very confused. Oh, I can, I can cheat a little bit there. Is there anything down here? So, I put... Maybe I need to put something else on there. Let's try putting like, the rules on there. Well, the rules are definitely on there now. Oh, wait, is that setting off the dispenser? It sounds like it. Yeah, it's setting off the dispenser. But the dispenser's not dispensing anything. Is it? I don't think it is. Okay. Well, there's a gold block here. But what's the purpose of this? Oh, wait. 
Aha. It gave me a lever. Oh, there's the anvil. Plus five levels. Yeah, level ten. Nice. So now, there's a stack of anvils here. So now, I can rename this to Ron. Case matters. So now the paper is called Ron. Can I get, get some more levels, please? Thank you. And then... Ding! Oh, I wanted to break the clay and see what was in there. Nice. Uh, mm. Didn't work. When life gives you melon, you gotta make that, take that melon. And make melonade. Nice. Portal 2 reference, everyone. This is a weird room. It looks like a jumping puzzle. But it might not be. Could be a trap. I'm looking ahead and not seeing any... Any hints that it's not a jumping puzzle. And that it's a trap. I'm just gonna... Park all this bitch. I'm quite good at this, actually. No, I'm, I'm pretty terrible, in fact. Oh god, these jumps are getting a little bit tricky. The hardest one better not be at the end, because that's always annoying when it comes to this kind of thing. But it looks like they're all relatively easy at the end, so that's not too bad. Fuck. Damn it, people! Why? 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 No, thank you. No, thank you. Oh my, what? what's wrong with me now? Suddenly gone from pro to loser. Why am I such a damn loser? And don't answer that question as to why I'm a loser, by the way. I already know it's because I'm a noob and I haven't L2P yet. So I wonder what the button was, the pressure pad was for, that I threw the, the rules on. Finally made it. Okay. Poison. Melonade. That's the melonade. Check out these crevices. You never never know. Right, on the pressure pad we go. Uh, ooh. Oh, oh my. Oh my. We have to jump into the mouth. I think the mouth's water. Pretty sure it is. Oh, oh careful. Oh, bollocks. <laughs> Oh, keep your inventories on. Nice. Uh oh, uh oh, uh oh, it's fine. There we go. Oh, wow, that's not very deep, is it? Here's a quick question for you. Oh, wait, there's a trick question, sorry. Can you break stone with a wooden pickaxe? Yeah, you can, I'm pretty sure. In What? You can, I'm pretty sure. Okay, whatever. Whatever, whatever, whatever. Wait, is the answer to look behind me or something? Fine. Oh, answer explanation. Why? Why not? Well, you have. Well, have you ever been in a mine shaft and tried to mine some stone with a wooden pick with a wooden pickaxe? I wasn't talking about Minecraft, but about real. Oh fuck you. <laughs> nice. Okay. Anvils. Oh, a really broken anvil here. <gasps> Pressure pads. Story of James. Okay. James was just a simple guy. Everything went fine for him until one day he woke up not knowing where who he is or how he, to get out. He was just in a junkyard. This is the story of James. Okay. Fine. Well. Oh, it's carpet, not buttons. That one's a button. Wait, is that. Oh. There's more buttons around the place here. There's a stone button there, which I can't activate. Hmm, okay. Well, I know how to get up here. Oh, chest apparently. Hmm. Oh, there's a sign over here. What does the sign say? Gold block, wink, wink. I need to find a lever. Cool. Oh, look at this. This weird walling. It's like clay, cobblestone, obsidian, netherrack. It's all weird. It's a shame that this didn't have a custom texture pack. I feel like that would have been... You could have done a little bit more there. But do you know what? It's awesome. The amount of effort going to put into this is way more than I could do. What the... It's a red ball of wall with buttons on it. Do I need to press, like, every button? Does one of these do something? 
Who threw out this giant strawberry? Oh, it's a giant strawberry. I still want to press every button on it, though. And yeah, why would you throw away a giant strawberry? Strawberries are not. Strawberries are awesome. Come on. Every button. I, I think this is a mistake, pressing every button on this. I don't think any of these... Does. I realize they're meant to be decorative for seeds, but... They're buttons, so I pressed them. There's a car here. I wonder if there's a sign on the other side. <gasps> no. Do the wheel buttons do anything? Oh, wait. There's item frames. <laughs> item frames that are headlights. Okay. What's this? Oh, it's a car on its side. <laughs> nice. Nice. There's a bridge up there. I need to get to that. Oh, I sense some parkour. Some slightly trickier jumps. Fortunately, there's only like four of them, so it's not really that difficult. Well, I'm over the other side of the, the locked gate now. I can now kind of uh, slow sound like around here and stuff. Let's fall down. Ow. I can now get out if needed. Okay. Uh-oh. Longer parkour detected. Though not verified, so for all I know, I'm doing this and it's pointless. Which is entirely possible. And in fact it is because I can jump up there. So that first section was pointless, but this next section is, is definitely not pointless. Chest, activate lever, call the key. Nothing else here. That's fine. Off we go back. Jump, be jump, ow, jump, be jump, be jump. Jump, be jump, be jump, be jump, be jump. In we go. Now I have a feeling we're gonna get teleported again here. Let's teleport, here we go. Sneak, sneaking is not your best friend. I agree. Careful. You can sneak off these. Sneaking does not keep you safe from this. Much better doing this kind of stuff where you just point down and keep your cursor like dead center if you can. As center as possible. There better not be any gaps in this. Let's have a look around actually. Oh nice. Nice white nice white room. Oh, we can you can do it like this as well. Just go sideways. That's the bother even turning. This makes it a little bit quicker, I feel. Ooh, careful, but careful, careful. Nearly there. Oh, wow, this should be easy to turn around here. Careful. Careful. Carefully does it. Oh, look at this. Like a boss. First time. If there's, if there's like a monster, that would be hilarious. Right, here we go. Oh. Yeah. Oh, I mean some kind of arena. There's your target. Jack. Oh, wait. <laughs> Welcome to the epic donkey battle of history. There's your target, Jack. Kill it before it lays eggs. What? Okay. I was given a sword story of Joe. Oh. Okay. Before it lays eggs. I have to kill it quickly. Quickly kill it. Die, Jack! Oh. Uh, oh. I'm now in a castle. Well, some kind of castle. It has, like, a weird fake nether portal up there, which is interesting. Oh, I sense world at its fear brushes. <laughs> oh, well. So look around the side. I always want to have a little bit of an explore. Oh, man, my food's going down fast. Oh, I've got three apples. Let's take one. Probably I shouldn't be sprinting everywhere, but you know what? It gets the job done loads faster. Loads faster. Oh, it's a graveyard. Cool. Let's look at these names. Edviz. Arik. Oh, these these names are all horrible names. Except that one. Elizabeth. Except Elizabeth is spelled slightly wrong. Oh, look at all these names. Anyone I recognize? Uh-oh. Aha! I'll do that in a minute. Player Rick... Locks, Osama, Gin, Dinner. Gandalf, do it if I break one of these. Well, first of all, I can't break these. So obviously I was meant to break the glowstone one. I want to have a look in the castle first. And see if there's anything obviously in there that also progresses me. Oh wow, it's not a castle, it's some kind of church. There's a chest here. Yep, yeah, let's put the music on. 
Yeah, creepy music. Go. There's pistons here. We've got priest talks. Let's let's take a seat. Here we go. We've got three pages of text. So we are gathered here today, cause cause of the loss we all had. Today is the day when Jack rise. What? When Jack rise upon us. To mention his death, we all will now sing a song for him. Here we go. Hit the road, Jack, and don't come back no more, no more, no more, no more. Hit the road, Jack, don't you come back no more. Hit the road, Jack, don't you come back no more, no more, no more. Hit the road, Jack. Okay, fine. So now you're allowed to dig up Jack's grave and go further. Okay, well, I've already done that. So, uh, actually, FYI, you're behind the times here, buddy. Let's have a look around here. There's like an iron door there. I want to have a peek at it. I like how the music totally complements this crazy scenario. It's fantastic. So, I'm going to go into Jack's grave, even though I've already kind of done that. Jack's grave, jumping it.